Hi there, Taurus. This is Kim here to do your reading. This reading is when you get it. It, will, it should resonate. Thanks for donating your energy today. You should get some messages in here asking your angels and your spirit guides to join us so that we can get messages for your highest good. Okay, this is the shaman's dream. The shaman's dream. Sky dancers, and it was surrender. It was kind of like that. So I have a feeling that this is definitely about kind of letting go I, to me it's feeling like letting go of anxiety and worries as best as you can in this moment in this now moment so taking a, a minute to kind of analyze how you feel and if there's any tense muscles you know trying to just consciously think of that muscle relaxing while you breathe will help <clears throat> right use of power wow this is eight and it's a multiple of six this is an eight multiple one so yay yay eights are <laughs> achievement prosperity abundance you like to see the eights all right so the root girl that disowned self it came out in the reverse this energy is the energy of if you've ever felt shamed or like you had to suppress a part of yourself because either it was bad or somebody just didn't understand you, you possibly shove things and repress things down all the way to the root so that you wouldn't think about this. But at the end of the day, this is the stuff that makes us whole, this card. The things that maybe even we press down because maybe some things um, were just simply conditioned and something that maybe somebody didn't like around you but not necessarily speaking for you so own that own that part of you that is beautif beautifully flawed and has a lot of layers more than an onion 25 is rest and renewal and that you know it is important especially in today's world where we can be really really busy um, it has a lot of royalty colors there, lavender, a lot of um, healing energy. The hummingbird is here, high vibe, high vibration. Yeah, it feels like you're changing fate or destiny or you're wanting to here. See what the in the shadows oracle cards have to say. I don't need your approval. I don't know how to let you go. Maybe that's what's talking about surrendering an old way of living, an old way of life. I do wish you well is coming out. So, and at the end of the day, these intentions are that everybody is well. Whoa. <laughs> I'm sorry. Flipping out. Flipping out. I forgive you. I'm waiting for an apology.
I couldn't tell you face to face. I couldn't tell you face to face. Let's just continue. I love myself enough to walk away. I focused on you instead of my pain. You didn't imagine it. I don't know what to say. And then it says, well, I'm sorry. <laughs> Maybe that's what, you know what I'm saying? Maybe that's what we should say. In that moment, I didn't care. I think it came, it was reversed. So there's this energy here of maybe there was caring and there was intentions here. Um, that might have something to do with that message for you. I'm waiting for an apology and I am not coming back. I am not coming back. And, oh, there's another one. I fantasize about you. And so, you know, I couldn't tell you face to face. I fantasize about you. Okay. So that is what I've got for that part. Let's go ahead and clear this deck uh, up. Let's clear the decks up and let's pull some Journey of the Secret Bee. main energy here right now for Taurus. The five of wands in the reverse because there's just no need for um, have any kind of arguing or competition. There's no need. There is a need to definitely bring back your laser focus. So no more games energy. What's the uh, challenge? The King of Wands is a challenge. Sometimes that stands for Leo. You know what? These both stand for Leo. Five of Wands and uh, the King of Wands. So, yeah, this is this is about. Um, it feels like that crown, the right use of power. It feels like that. It feels strong. It feels confident feels um, maybe inspirational to others, a role model that you might be for us. Heart of the matter is the seven of cups in the reverse. Um, at the heart of the matter, okay, so there's something that we're seeing very clear right now. Something that we're seeing clearly Maybe it's like not having any kind of influence to distract, distract our focus from what it is that we really want. What's the past energy? Past energy is the four of wands. I have perfected work, perfected work. Um, this is great because this means um, that in here, I think these are both for the past energy. How beautiful. So the four of wands perfected work. 
1111, purpose, sole purpose being here. Nine of Cups in the reverse is somewhat of a disappointment, um, maybe just in some of the decisions of what we decided to keep for ourselves. Like um, the Nine of Cups, you can be satiated by anything. So if you chose alcohol instead of food and you were hungry, then there you go. That would be a disappointing choice. So just a very, you know, crude example of what that is. Um, justice in the reverse here. Libra energy, possibly. Possibly. Um, it's about the scales always being weighed. Um, also have the Empress energy in reverse. So, Empress energy working on oneself, really focusing on themselves. Yeah. Perfected work. Perfected work. Something that you have done immaculately. Okay, is that good? Do I have that? Okay. And the now moment. What's the now moment about? The world. It's a new world. It's a new dimension. It is new, new, new. Everything about this energy. Mm -hmm. So the light is beginning to shine. And it's dissipating the darkness. It's dissipating and it's showing things that were really nothing to fear. The world energy. Could be associated with Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio. Doesn't have to though. It is an energy that is fixed though. So that's interesting to say that this world is here and you don't have to worry about this type, this good next step up world you don't have to worry about that going away anytime soon that is here to stay for you new energy future energy the seven of swords energy but i have the six of swords too earned success so yeah, um, not doing anything here um, that would be possibly deceptive. I don't know if it's talking about that or if it's talking about um, trying, but like why try on something, on some kind of issue? Because it says futility, and futility isn't necessarily, a, I mean, if you look up the definition for the word futility, it's like, this is futile. This is so many attempts and something not working. So, let me get another card for that, because I don't want to just leave it at that, right? Because it's never just that. Yeah, finding alchemy and chemistry... And the challenge might be your own self here with the king of disc finding balance within yourself the yin and the yang king of disc temperance energy which it says alchemy because you're constantly transmuting energies always transmuting energies i have the nine of wands in the reverse as for you how you are feeling so there's something that, yeah, you just don't want to fight. You don't want to fight over it. Don't want to play any kind of games or you don't want any drama your way, it feels like. What about the environment? In the environment. Hmm. Star energy and the world energy? My goodness. So it's like really getting some kind of acclaim for all that you do. It's beautiful. Strength card. Have strength. Have confidence. What is the hope or fear here? Okay, so this is your own attitude. It's it's your own attitude. So being pessimistic and looking at something as half empty, that is possibly like the issue. Okay. So that 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 can be fixed basically is like maybe you're hoping um that that you do have the ability to see things as nice and positive in your life. And of course you do. Hang on. I don't think that one's really wanting to come out but because it didn't actually flip out, but it was the sun in reverse. So it, it is it's just telling you that this is correct 
here <clears throat> you don't have to feel so guarded you can break down your walls what's the outcome nice moving away from a difficult time that was really um stormy and this says on the card earn success because you're going towards a much calmer time the seven of wands in the reverse is like it's almost like this nine of wands it's like not wanting to advocate or advocate for something or someone earned success leaving a paradigm of thinking behind for this world energy is what it seems like and finding your truth and what you want to advocate for there's leo leo and the sun and strength want to come out but they haven't here so that's what I've got for you guys. Any love and light. Thanks for letting me do your reading, guys. There's um, a full view of all of those cards. All right. Bye, guys. You're appreciated.